Hi everyone, it's Anne here from Anne Makes. Uh, today I am sharing with you what goodies I got at um, my the conference I attended uh, over the weekend. Uh, well, end of last week and over the weekend. I went to the uh, SNAP conference. This is my badge here. So uh, some people have been asking me what is that? It's a conference for influencers uh, like myself, for bloggers, who are in the lifestyle category, uh, who cook, create, uh, celebrate. Um, mostly, we're mostly moms. There are men in there now this year. There are more and more men, which is great. And uh, the categories we focus on are anything having to do with family, uh, food, crafts, home decor, home renovations, things like that. So uh, yeah, so I was at that conference where we were about 300 uh, influencers there. And uh, it's a lot of fun to go to this conference. It's all, the best part is always uh, meeting up with all the old friends and uh, chatting and you know, the social aspect is so much fun. And uh, there are activities for us. There are classes, there's business classes, there is hands-on classes, uh, and the hotel where we stay is called uh, the Little America Hotel. Uh, here's my, <laughs> my, pack, my packet from my uh, room key, and uh, if I can show you, here's one, uh, one picture, you can see this is what one shot of the hotel from the outside. Not that really doesn't um, justify, you know, how, how beautiful this hotel is. It's just a beautiful hotel on the inside. And um, it's very luxurious and fancy. And uh, really, these pictures do not do it justice. And these are just uh, the little packets of the chocolates. There's little mint chocolates here. Um, and these are put on our pillows every night. They come and turn down our, our bedding and leave this for us in, in our rooms. And I, I stayed in the tower um, of the hotel. That is the oldest part. And it's very, very, very nice. It's just gorgeous. So, um, and the food is good. I mean, it, it's really, really good food. So it's a wonderful Play. It's a wonderful venue for uh, the conference, and it's not too big. Some conferences I go to, they're just like, I'm so tired from all the walking, and this is just, it's just the perfect size, so it's fun. And a lot of sponsors uh, are there. They sponsor the whole event, and uh, there, there's companies there that uh, want to meet with us influencers because they want to work with us. So um, that's why I go to this. And I just want to show you that the first night uh, we had an activity called um, Eat Dessert First, if I remember correctly. That I, I'm sorry if I, I butchered the title of it. And the, the whole thing was organized by Ritzy Parties. And that is my friend, my dear friend, Christy. Uh, amazing. I'll show you her tag here. Uh, Ritzy Parties. That's her little tag there. Uh, she is such a talented person. She's also a designer and she is just like the party planner of party planners. She's just amazing. And it, the, the place was amazing. It was gorgeous. It was just beautiful. Everything was so well decorated. The theme was candies and sweets and all the, um, the people that were there that were including her and the staff were all dressed up. and. <laughs> They were just adorable. And one of the activities that we got to do was to make these lovely headpieces. And this is mine. So this is what I made. You can see this little cupcake that goes in my head. So, um, so they provided all the supplies there in, and the tools on the spot for us to, to make these lovely uh, headband pieces. And so there's a lot of sponsors that contributed to this. I think there was Oriental Trading and there was, I think, Consumer Crafts and Kuhnenfeld and I follow and uh, Plaid probably. I apologize if I'm forgetting anybody in there. But uh, yeah, they provide all these supplies and it was just, it was so much fun. So that is one of the things that I got to make 
there. Of course, there was so many goodies. There was food galore. <laughs> there was a lot of great food, a lot of sweet stuff, lots of yummy hors d'oeuvres, uh, lots and lots of fun. They were given little goodie bags, and in there, there's like some specially shaped treats, like this one here, a little lollipop, candy lollipops, a lot of that. So uh, that's one of the things I got to make. Another thing that we made were candy kebabs. Yes, here's one of the candy kebabs that I made. Um, it's a little, little squish because it was in my suitcase. So, it was, you know, it was just a, a little skewer, with an end there, and you just slide on a whole bunch of candy. So these were the candy kebabs that we were able to make. They handed out little pinwheels. Of course, I chose a pink one because that is my color. <laughs> and um, there was also an activity where we could decorate an apron and there was a contest. However, I didn't have time to decorate my apron there and the aprons were provided by Canvas Core. And again, I want to give a shout out to another friend of mine and fellow designer, Candy Rosenberg, who is there, who was there with Canvas Core. They provided these wonderful aprons for us. They're just beautiful, tough uh, aprons, and they really, these are great for crafting. They're great for cooking. They're great, you know, they're really good when you want to get messy. And the contest was to decorate it. So I do, I still have to do that. I still have to decorate it. I did take a few pieces of trim home with me so I could decorate it when I got home. And another activity, and I did have the time to complete this project is, oh, here it is, was this wooden spoon. So there were uh, wood burning tools there and wooden spoons and we could play with the wood burning tools yes the hotel was smelling like burnt wood <laughs> it was so funny and this is the one i made i made the it's my first time wood burning and i made this spoon i got i wrote the code sugar and spice and i just that did all these decorations and then i put the my uh channel's name on there and I painted the handle, added some sparkly paint, and all the products were provided by um, Plaid for this. So uh, that was another thing that I made. And there was also uh, cookie decorating, which I did. The cookie did not make it home, sorry, but it, I think it came home in my tummy. And <laughs> uh, oh, what else was there? So. If I'm forgetting something, I'm, I'm sorry. But yeah, that was what we did on the opening night. It was a lot of fun. We're all a bunch of, oh, so many of us are very crafty. And, and so it was a lot of fun for us to do that. And uh, I was very lucky. I won one of the first prizes of the event. I got this wonderful kit uh, for baking. Uh, well, for decorating baked goods. And this came from the sweet tooth fairy so i got this wonderful kit of sprinkles now check this out these are teeny tiny little stars and confetti and little heart it's just it's like edible confetti that's what it is and look at this this is like edible glitter <laughs> and this it's really hard for you to see this on on the on the screen here but these are tiny 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 little star shaped confetti sprinkles edible they're just it's amazing again um this is the sweet tooth fairy and the bakers the bakers party shop they were the sponsors of this and uh, I, I couldn't hold it all up together i also got this beautiful sweet serving platters so i got a set of uh, cake platters and they're just so so pretty so i want all that thank you uh ritzy party sweet tooth fairy the baker's shop and i do want to give a shout out to every sponsor uh, that was there uh, i hope i don't forget anybody and plaid was there and canvas core there was also sparkling ice uh, polaroid um Oh, there were quite a few uh, companies. Hold on, I'll, I'll get 
So I didn't want to forget anybody. There was Evite that was there. Uh, hashtag Evite20. Ritzy Parties. Hashtag Ritzy Parties. Flora Crafts. Hashtag Make It Fun Crafts. Oriental Trading Company. Hashtag Oriental Trading. Sparkling Ice Beverages. Hashtag Get Fizzy. Kunin Felt. Hashtag Create with Kunin. Expo International. Hashtag Expo Snap. Hashtag X point the baker's party shop hashtag sprinkle snap plaid crafts hashtag plaid crafts thermo web hashtag thermo web hashtag toe butterfly snaps charity wings hashtag charity wings amalfi decor hashtag amalfi decor canvas core Hashtag snap your apron and consumer crafts hashtag consumer crafts So these were the sponsors of that event and I just wanted to give uh, a shout out to all of them Thank you very much for uh, making that event uh, ha You know be possible. It was a lot of fun so uh, also at the conference I was able to take some classes and I will get around to showing you uh, some of the stuff I did and uh, many of the spots the sponsors that were there were very generous and giving us gifts and handouts um, you know to promote their products and to talk to to meet with us and talk with us about how we could work together uh, Rust-Oleum, Testers Rust-Oleum, you know, I already work with uh, this wonderful company. They were there and they were giving us these cups and we could go over to Swig, which was another sponsor there, and we had access to free beverages all the whole time of the conference, all three days that we were there, and these delicious, delicious cookies. Oh, they were so good, those cookies. And they really encourage us to um, drink a lot of liquids and eat a lot of carbs because that is one way to help prevent altitude sickness when you are there because the altitude is very high. Salt Lake City is way, 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 way above uh, sea level. It's so high that uh, people sometimes suffer from altitude sickness, especially if they're they're not from there and they're not used to it. And I did suffer from altitude sickness on my first trip there. And trust me, you don't want to do, you don't want to go through that. It's horrible. So yeah, I made sure this year to uh, be hydrated beforehand, drink plenty of water in the weeks coming before the trip. And uh, during my stay, I made sure to drink lots and lots of water. And well, sometimes I added some fruit to my water and some delicious syrups that they had there. So it was fun. And uh, so that was uh, Tester's Rust-Oleum. They also had uh, samples of craft paints to give us. Uh, this is their matte Tester's craft paint. I've worked with their paints before. I love their paints. They are really smooth. They're very nice to work with. They also had the other enamel paints, but unfortunately, I can't, I couldn't travel with those because they are, uh, they have a label on them that says they're flammable. So I was concerned that if I had that in my suitcase, that security would just pull that out. And with reason, it says flammable on it. So I did not bring any of that back. Another sponsor that was uh, there was uh, Plaid. So they, a little bit of competitor to, to Testers Rust-Oleum. And I also work with Plaid and they wanted to showcase their brand new marbling paints. And so I got some samples of marbling paint and it's really fun to play with this, uh, to pour it. And it has like a plastic feel once you, once you use it. And it does look like what's on the lids here. It marbling. So it's a lot of fun. They showed us paint pouring with their products and I've learned a few tricks about paint pouring that's much easier than the tr the way I learned how to do it with the you know the toxic fumes and stuff. This they have a 
formulation that makes it very safe for children to do that. They also have new glitter paint uh, made for glassware that can go in the dishwasher. So I got to play with a little bit of that. And uh, so they had, they had ton Plaid had a whole room where we could go play with all their products, any product we wanted. We could make plaques, we could decorate notebooks, we can decorate glassware. We just, it was a lot of fun. And um, I got this bag from them. So it says, Plaid Crafters are my tribe. <laughs> so yes, that's so true. So I got that. Now another sponsor uh, that was there and also to work to, to meet with uh, influencers to work was, um, I just drew a blank. Another sponsor that was there was all about uh, website security and uh, the correct name escapes me right now and I don't want to butcher it so I will put it on the screen uh, with the correct spelling. And they gave us these little webcam covers. There's a little slider doohickey that you can put on your computer to put over the camera eye so it can stay shut. And I just thought these were really handy. So I uh, got that. I uh, another one of the sponsors there was uh, Sherwin Williams, the yes, the paint company, the house paint company, and they were very, very generous in giving us these uh, gift cards to, uh, in exchange for a can of paint. So I can bring this to a Sherwin Williams store and get a free gallon of paint of any color of my choosing. And they had these lovely little pins to give us. So this is really nice. I'm glad I got the gift card because bringing a gallon of paint home, uh, that would have been really heavy in my suitcase. <laughs> so uh, that's another thing that I got. And uh, there was a company that, there called savings.com. And savings.com is, um, is a program for us influencers who work with affiliates and uh, I can't explain it correctly but it, it's about keeping track of all the affiliates that we work with and just making our lives easier that's because there's a there's a lot of copy and pasting and back and forth and electronic paperwork to do when we work with affiliates and uh, and so this is kind of a system that helps put it all together for us so yeah if you're not if you're not an influencer it's not interesting to you but for me this is really interesting and they were giving us these doodads and i saw a lot of people using these and this clips onto your iphone or your android phone and it has three different light settings and it just like lights up everything. It's kind of like a flash and a strobe light all in one uh, for when you're filming. So that was really nice of them to give us that. Uh, so I got that from them. I also got uh, hand sanitizer, lip balm, everything you need to survive a conference basically. And that came in really handy and I used all that. And I still have some of that left of course, but that was really, really handy. So thank you so much savings.com. And uh, next, I want to show you what uh, Polaroid was there and what uh, I got from them. Because I got so many things, I just laid everything out on my island. I spread it all around, and that's why I'm going around in this uh, circle to show you what I got. Um, so Polaroid uh, was there, and uh, they had an activity where we could make a door hanger. So we could pose for a picture in their photo booth. They would print out the picture on their brand new uh, pop Polaroid. They call it the Polaroid Pop. It's an instant uh, printing Polaroid type of camera. It's very, very small, very compact, very efficient. And it comes with the, um, you know, the, the decoration all around it, this Polaroid thing and it's tiny it's fun and uh, then we were able to make a, like a little door hanger we just had to decorate it ourselves and I really appreciate that and of course they had big tote bags for us to advertise their new Polaroid pop here so we got that 
and it's an idea book um, for using some of their products. So that was that was fun. And there was a party on the Saturday night. There was an eight, uh, 80s prom night theme. <laughs> And we were encouraged to dress up in 80s style, and some of us did go all the way. I uh, showed up with big hair and shoulder pads, and you can't really see me because I'm all the way back there, but this was my little tribe uh, at, the, uh, at the party. And they printed out these little pictures for us, and we got these little cards that we could make uh, and bring home. And Polaroid gave us each uh, a, this kit to uh, take home with us. And I guess this is a branch of Polaroid. It says Happy here. And it's a craft tool kit for us crafty people. And inside is there's a whole bunch of nice little craft tools. So that was very nice of Polaroid. Thank you very much. And another sponsor that was uh, there was Floracraft and Floracraft makes of uh, all the styrofoam and flower arranging and tapes for flower arranging and they will be this is this is something brand new it's not out on the market I'm giving you a sneak peek of this this will be out for the Christmas season they will be selling kits where you get a styrofoam base it could be uh, either you, you could buy the wreath, you could buy the tree ornament, or you could buy the uh, round ball ornament, and it comes with these sticky back dots that you apply to the surface of the styrofoam, and to which you get to stick on Hershey Kisses. And you can make something similar to that. So you get you get a decoration, a gift, chocolate, all in one. Isn't that awesome? So their booth was decorated Christmas style. It was all red and green, and it was full. The whole booth was covered in Hershey's Kisses. I'm glad I wasn't there to set up that booth. <laughs> There's a lot of Hershey's Kisses there. And of course they gave us a lot of, of chocolate, which was, ah, I don't complain about the chocolate. And um, they also gave us these Hershey's Kisses lip balm. So I thought that was really, really nice. And of course uh, this is, you know, they're looking to work with influencers to promote their product. And they have a contest for us uh, to who could make, you know, the fanciest uh, decorations. So. Uh, that'll be a fun thing to enter so and uh, just in case you need to know you need two bags of Hershey's Kisses to cover this entire thing with the with the chocolates so my recommendation is if you ever see this product in the stores as you buy three bags of Hershey's Kisses yes two for the decoration and one for you <laughs> so uh, next what can I show you? Okay, so I took some classes. So I moved you over to this side because this is where the stuff from my classes is. Now, uh, none of my projects got finished uh, because I, I socialize way too much when I'm there. <laughs> uh, but I took a amigurami uh, crochet class. So that is a Japanese style of crochet. And the idea was to complete these little owls. Of course, I did not complete mine because I'm very slow at crocheting, but I got to take all the supplies home so I could finish my little owl at home. And I want to show you uh, what stage my little owl is at. So this is the bottom part of the little owl. That's how far I got. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I'm thinking if, if I don't get to finish the whole owl, Snowball will have a cute little hat. So, uh, but this is what Amigurami crochet is. It's basically simple crochet, knit, crocheted in the round and you increase as you go around. So I got that. I did, I took that class. So I, to learn Amigurami crochet. I also took a uh, abstract 
art foiling class and where we played with leaf uh, leaf silver and gold and such so um, this is part of my project it's not my best project but it was uh, it was a very sticky situation but it was fun to play with the uh, the leaf the silver leaf and gold leaf and they also gave us an extra bag canvas bags to take home to uh, do that up ourselves and another class that I took was with Beverly McCullough from Flamingo Toes. She is an amazing, um, she is an amazing uh, embroiderer. Uh, you please go check out her website if you are interested in learning how to embroider. She is a fabulous teacher. Uh, she did, she does a really good job in taking the ultimate beginner and turning them into an embroiderer, confident embroiderer. Uh, she's amazing. And uh, I had taken a class with her before in the past and I, I really, really liked her. So we were being taught how to do um, embroidery stitches, the Lazy Daisy, the, uh, and I already forgot the name of the stitches, of course, but uh, this is the project we were working on. And of course, I did not finish this one either. My intention was to finish stuff on the airplane, uh, but let's be honest, on the airplane, even though I, I paid for a better seat, you still like this, so it's really hard to embroider or crochet or knit on the airplane, because it's just like, there's no room, you know. Yeah. So, um, next, I want to show you I took a brush lettering class with uh, Brittany from uh, Tombow USA and so uh, this was, I really enjoyed this class. Uh, it was about learning to uh, do brush lettering with a uh, pen here, the Fudo News, okay I just won't even say it, that's it. Uh, pen and uh, we learned it's like doing calligraphy with this special pen from Tombow and Fudo Suzu Nuki pen there. So, uh, yeah, so to uh, do the um, calligraphy with this, this pen, and that was fun. And they uh, gave each and every one of us um, who was staying in the tower part of the hotel uh, this kit. Uh, these were in our rooms uh, one night. And uh, they had uh, this little case with uh, some different tools. And is this the one? Yeah, there's some different uh, writing implements and some adhesive. Now, uh, another class I took, and I think this is the last class I have to show you, uh, that was hands on is. Uh, a watercoloring class again uh, a wonderful instructor and, and I wish I could remember her name I will try to find the, her name a uh, very talented watercolor artist very good teacher and we uh, were taught the basics of watercoloring how to make a color you know learned about the color chart and uh, brush strokes and you know just how to paint with watercolors and we were given samples of wonderful like really really nice watercolor paper and a really good brush so i got to bring these home and i'm very glad i that i was given that so another one of the so of course uh, these companies not only were there for the classes but they were also there as sponsors and so this company the provided the paper is a German company called Hannah Muli. I'm going to, I'm totally butchering that and I apologize. They have like some of the, some of the best watercolor paper, really. And the brushes were provided by Royal and Lang Nickel. And this one has the scraping tip, which is really nice to have. I met with the people of Close to My Heart, which is a direct sale uh, scrapbooking and card making company. 
and I really love their products and they are there looking to work with uh, influencers for uh, their advertising and their media and so we had a little activity where we made little cards like this one and they were very generous in giving us these really cute cute aprons from close to my heart and I haven't even opened it yet um, and it's a good thing I left it in the plastic bag in the plastic bag considering my suitcase got soaked at the airport so this was the only thing that was dry I could have worn this after discovering all my clothes were soaked so th it's this lovely apron it's like I've got a denim and these colored fabrics it's real cute and these little tabs to tie around your neck or floor or this floral pattern cotton so I got this apron from them and I'm, I love it and uh, some beautiful catalogs of course to showcase all their new products and information about uh, working with them as an influencer so that was another thing that I got another company that I met that was there was crafters companion and they were giving out samples of their new products and uh, they were there looking to, to get a feel for what it would be like to work with influencers and uh, so they were handing out some of their new products and I got to talk to them about some possible uh, future projects which was really nice and I just got a sample of some of all their new products including some uh this is a sparkly a sparkly brush i think and, and including some water brushes i call this their mixed set so there's different sizes of water brushes to use for water coloring or other crafts and the another company that i have uh, i work with already is home right uh, home right is the maker of these uh, paint sprayers, commercial, industrial, and uh, crafters version of paint sprayers. And uh, they were there and they were allowing you to take one of their wooden plaques, so you would get a little plaque like this, and uh, you could spray paint it and turn it into something pretty like this one. So uh, I have a before and after of the different model to share with you. So it was to showcase their paint sprayer, their uh, their paint spraying tent, and their turned up all the products they have, all the tools that they make, and uh, so I stopped by there. I got to play a little bit and uh, learned about their new tools, and of course I hope to get some more of their new tools. So new on the scene and new as a sponsor at Snap this year is this company called. Uh, Meow Biotics. They also have, I think, Fido Biotics. Yeah, Fido Biotics and Meow Biotics. And they're a company that makes um, cat and dog uh, probiotics. And uh, I was able to come home with a sample of their hairball buster because I talk talk to them about my snowball and how my snowball is in all my videos despite the fact that i am not a pet influencer uh but <laughs> she's in all my videos and she gets a lot of attention and she does have fur balls so uh i was given this sample to try out with snowball and they have a great affiliate program as well and i do hope that this is uh, this is this is a good thing i hope it works with snowball i hope she takes it and uh, I'm looking forward to trying this out. It's all natural, it's probiotics, it's, it's actually healthy for her. It's supposed to help her digestive system, you know, and give her a shiny coat and all that. And she's already a super healthy cat, except for the fur balls. So uh, this will hopefully just help her out a little bit. So I look forward to trying the Meow Biotics. <laughs> and uh, I'll keep you posted about that. Now, new at Snap this year was Annie's Publishing. And I was really excited that they were there because I am familiar with, a, a little bit familiar with Annie's Publishing because I 
as a crafty person, I have bought many of their uh, print publications in the past, such as The Country Sampler, and they also are the makers of Creative Knitting. And um, so I have I have bought these magazines here in Canada, and I so I was really excited that they were going to be there, and I got to learn so much about the company. They they let me ask them a ton of questions because that's the type of person I am. I just had so much so many questions for them, and they explained to me all the print publications they do. They have these online programs. They have this like online studio thing. Excuse me there. <laughs> I just just chalking on my ch chalking choking on my own saliva. Whoa. All right, but thankfully I have some cold coffee right beside me to help with that. Um, and it, uh, what was I saying? They have all these print publications. They are online. They have uh, websites. They have uh, subscription online online subscription programs. They also have these uh, monthly kit subscriptions for different uh different interests and crafts and skills and they just have so much to do with the how to the crafts the diys and it's i'm really really excited to maybe work with them and uh i i really look forward to uh playing with their i'm sorry working with their products and so I was able to take home uh, some samples of their print publication and I got their Annie's Coloring Pages 3 book. And I think this is beautiful. It's, you've got all these colorings inside and quotes and a whole bunch of instructions at the beginning um, of the, like the history of coloring and color, what coloring tools are. Uh, coloring techniques so this like I think this is a great a great buy uh, if you come across this and I know I've seen their publications in, in Walmart because I don't have a lot of choices around where I live so uh, you know if you're like me keep your eyes open if you're interested in this uh, and go check out their website uh, Annie's um, Annie's and I like their name too so I got, I got the boutique style crochet. So I got their crochet magazine, their creative knitting, uh, a country sampler issue, and um, a quilter's world magazine. And like I said, already the coloring book. So yes, I got too many projects to uh, to make now I know I, but I love it I love it I love being crafty you guys know that so gosh I hope I didn't forget anybody any of the sponsors uh, this is what came home with me and my suitcase that <laughs> survived um, my trip there if you watched a previous video you know what I'm talking about so these are all the fun things I got. I look forward to making stuff with that and sharing it with you guys and learning more about these sponsors and these companies and having uh, new opportunities. It's very exciting. And uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Wait a minute, wait a minute, don't go anywhere. How could I forget this? And I know why I forgot it because it got buried under everything else, but the most exciting thing about my attending a snap conference 2018 was that at the very end at the closing keynote speech uh they said look under your chairs we we put something there and uh turned over my chair and i saw this and i was like oh yeah what is this you know and i had i saw someone going to the stage and I was like oh good for them they won I'm not sure what they won but yay good for them and here I'm holding this thing and my friends are like Ann you got one too you got one too I'm like huh really yo you didn't get this you know <laughs> duh uh well then I just fell into shock because I won a ticket to next year's conference uh, so here I start waving it and I just didn't know what to say really because like, oh my god, I actually won. <laughs> I won a ticket to next year's conference. So thank you to the organizers of SNAP uh, for 
doing this and uh, I'm just I was so excited I was in shock really <laughs> when the, when I I got this ticket from under the chair so yeah whoo, I guess I'm going to snap again uh, and yeah so that was the the highlight of my whole conference I guess so uh, again thanks so much for watching sorry about uh, um, cutting in and doing this part over uh, but yeah I won <laughs> <laughs> I hope you will give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, please like, comment, share, uh, subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and I will catch you after uh, my next video. Bye!